Big news! More stimulus checks are on the way. I've got all the details on the new $2,000 direct payments that are going out on February 23 Road. This latest round of stimulus is specifically for Social Security, SSI, SSDI, and VA beneficiaries. If you receive any of these benefits, keep reading to find out if you qualify and how you'll get your money. The payments start processing in just two days, so make sure to get the full breakdown before checks start hitting accounts. This is huge financial relief for millions of Americans. Don't miss this important stimulus update. Who is eligible? Let's start by discussing who is eligible for this brand new round of $2,000 stimulus checks. The payments are going out to people who receive the following benefits. Social Security, SSA. Supplemental Security Income, SSI. Social Security Disability Insurance, SSDI. Veterans Affairs, VA, Benefits. So if you currently receive monthly payments for any of these programs, you are eligible for the additional $2,000 stimulus. It's being treated as a supplement to your usual benefit amount. Importantly, you do not need to take any action or fill out any forms to get the money. As long as you are enrolled in these programs and receive regular payments, the stimulus will come to you automatically. It is being sent out directly from the Social Security Administration and Veterans Affairs. When will it arrive? The stimulus payments will start hitting accounts on February 23, 2022. This is just two days away. The money will be sent either by direct deposit or through the mail as a debit card or paper check. If you already have direct deposits set up for your Social Security or VA benefits, then expect the $2,000 to be deposited on February 23. This is the fastest way to receive your stimulus money. For those without direct deposit, the SSA will send your payment as a debit card or paper check in the mail. It may take several additional days or even a few weeks for the money to reach you. So direct deposit recipients will have access to their stimulus faster. The key is that all payments will be sent out on February 23 RD or shortly after. So make sure to watch your bank account or mailbox closely over the coming days and weeks. If you're eligible, the $2,000 is coming. Payment method and timing. Here is some more detail on how and when you will receive your stimulus based on how you usually get benefits. Social Security. Direct deposit arrives February 23. Debit card arrives early March. Paper check arrives early March. SSI. Direct deposit arrives February 23. Debit card arrives early March. Paper check arrives early March. SSDI. Direct deposit arrives February 23. Debit card arrives early March. Paper check arrives early March. VA benefits. Direct deposit arrives February 23. Debit card arrives early March. Paper check arrives early March. So in summary, make sure to watch your bank account or mail in the coming weeks. All payment methods will be sent out starting February 23, 2022. Direct deposit recipients get their money first, followed by debit cards and paper checks over the following weeks. Will I receive multiple payments? An important question many people have is whether they will receive multiple $2,000 payments if they get more than one type of benefit. The answer is yes. If you are enrolled in multiple federal benefit programs like Social Security and SSI, you will qualify for each of the $2,000 stimulus payments. For example, if you receive both Social Security and VA benefits, you will get two separate stimulus checks for $2,000 from each agency. The payments stack. The only requirement is that you are actively receiving regular monthly payments from these programs. As long as you are, you will receive multiple stimulus checks totaling $2,000 each. For most eligible Americans, this means $4,000 or even $6,000 in total stimulus aid. This is huge financial relief from the government to help older, disabled and veteran Americans through the ongoing pandemic and economic recovery. Do I need to take any action? The great news is you do not need to take any steps or fill out any paperwork to receive your stimulus money. It will come to you automatically based on your enrollment in Social Security, SSI, SSDI or VA benefits. 
the Social Security Administration and Veterans Affairs will handle everything on their end. They have the data on all Americans receiving these benefits. So as long as you are eligible and enrolled, your stimulus will arrive on its own either by direct deposit, debit card, or paper check. You earn these benefits through years of hard work and paying your dues. Now the government is providing extra relief through these programs. There are no forms, applications, or claims to file. Sit back and your money will come. Use of funds, bills, debt, supplies. $2,000 is a sizable stimulus payment that can be used to take care of all sorts of bills, expenses, and household needs. Here are some smart ways you can make use of your stimulus money. Pay down credit card, medical or other debt. Cover utility bills and housing costs. Pay for medications and medical supplies. Stock up on household goods and groceries. Invest in upgrades around the house. Save for retirement or an emergency fund. This stimulus is meant to provide financial stability and relief during an economically difficult time. Use it to take care of essentials, pay down debt and generally strengthen your household finances. Investing in your family and home is what stimulus funds are for. Taxes on stimulus checks. One question many have is whether the stimulus payment will be taxable or lead to any tax implications. The good news is the $2,000 payment will not be counted as taxable income. You will not need to pay income tax on your stimulus money even though it supplements your Social Security or VA benefits. The goal of the stimulus is to provide immediate financial relief and economic stability. Taxing it would defeat the purpose. So you can rest assured your payment will come to you tax-free. The stimulus also will not impact your eligibility for federal benefit programs or have any other tax penalties. It comes to you free and clear as emergency financial aid during the ongoing pandemic and recovery. Credit for Dependents SSI, SSDI, VA only. While Social Security retirement beneficiaries will receive $2,000 flat, SSI, SSDI and VA beneficiaries may qualify for additional funds if they have dependent children under age 17. If you claim a child as a dependent and have verified this with the SSA or VA, you will receive an extra $1,000 added to your stimulus. For example, if you are an SSDI recipient with two kids, you would get $4,000 total. This child credit only applies to SSI, SSDI, and VA, not regular Social Security. To qualify, you must have verified dependents currently on record with the SSA or VA. If the children are not on file with these agencies, you will not receive the extra child credit, unfortunately. So make sure to consider dependents and additional funds you may be eligible for. Stimulus payments can be even higher for those with children under 17 who are verifiably claimed as dependents. Contact your local SSA office with any issues. Hopefully this breakdown gives you a clear sense of when your stimulus will arrive and how much you will receive. But if you run into any issues or have specific questions, make sure to contact your local Social Security Administration or Veterans Affairs office for help. They can look into the status of your payment, update your dependent information, correct any errors with your benefits, and more. Local SSA and VA offices will have the detailed information to help with any problems or questions that come up. You can locate your nearest SSA office using the SSA Office Locator tool online. This will provide phone numbers, directions, and operating hours. For VA assistance, you can call the VA hotline at 1-800-827-1000 or find one of many VA facilities across the country. VA staff will have the tools and resources to address any concerns or errors with your stimulus payment. Don't hesitate to call or visit your local office if you encounter any issues. They are there to serve you. The federal government is delivering major relief through these new targeted stimulus checks. $2,000 payments are being sent to all Social Security, SSI, SSDI, and Veterans Affairs beneficiaries starting February 23, 2022. As long as you are enrolled in these programs and receiving regular benefits, keep an eye on your bank account or mailbox. Your stimulus is on the way very soon. Make sure to spend this extra money wisely on essential expenses, bills, debt, and household needs. It can provide a real boost during these difficult economic times. Enjoy the coming stimulus and breathe a little easier knowing financial relief is around the corner.
This will help stabilize households and communities as we continue recovering from the pandemic and associated economic impacts. Helpful aid is always welcome, especially when so clearly needed. In the first four minutes of this video, I really want to drive home just how impactful this news is. This is a huge deal that will allow people to receive increased social security benefits if they wait to claim them. Let's dive right in and talk about the details. The news is that if you wait until after your full retirement age to claim social security benefits, you can receive delayed retirement credits that will increase the amount you get each month. Your full retirement age depends on when you were born, but for most people it's somewhere between 66 and 67 years old. So what does this mean? It means that if you hold off on claiming benefits past your full retirement age, your monthly check will be bigger thanks to these credits. We're talking about an 8% increase for every year you delay, up until you turn 70. That's a pretty nice bonus. Some experts recommend waiting as long as possible before filing for benefits so that you can maximize the amount you receive each month. With these delayed retirement credits, your patience really pays off. Just think about the impact this could have on your monthly income in retirement. That's thousands of extra dollars over the course of a year that you could enjoy. This news makes waiting to claim your benefits much more appealing. I don't know about you, but this update really caught my attention. Being able to receive larger social security payments each month can make retirement more comfortable and secure. It's not often we hear about changes that directly benefit people like this. Now let's really break this down. Why is this news so important for people planning for retirement? Because deciding when to claim social security is one of the most impactful financial decisions you can make. It requires careful consideration of all factors. Many people end up claiming too early before they are eligible for the maximum benefit amount. That ends up reducing the size of their checks for the rest of their life. But with these new delayed retirement credits, waiting longer pays off more than ever before. Let's do some simple math to see the impact. Let's say your full retirement age is 67, but you claim benefits at 62 that's 60 months or 5 years early. By claiming early, your monthly benefit amount could be reduced by up to 30%. However, if you waited until age 70 to claim that's 3 years past your full retirement age then your benefit would be 24% higher thanks to the delayed retirement credits. That's a huge difference. Being able to receive bigger payments can help cover increased costs in retirement and allow you to maintain your quality of life. This update recognizes that waiting should be rewarded. Now let's pivot and in the remaining 6 minutes of the video I want to explain who is eligible for these increased social security benefits and how you can claim them. Let's help people understand how to take advantage of this positive news. First, who qualifies for the delayed retirement credits? The good news is that they are available to anyone who is eligible for Social Security retirement benefits. You earn credits when you work and pay Social Security taxes. Most people need at least 10 years of work, or 40 credits, to receive retirement benefits. As long as you are eligible based on your work history, you can take advantage of the credits. Now, how do you actually claim the higher benefit amount? The process is fairly simple. You just need to wait until after your full retirement age, which is somewhere between 66 and 67 for most people, before applying for benefits. I always recommend checking your social security statements, which you can access online by creating a My Social Security account. This will allow you to see your estimated benefits at different claiming ages. That way you can make an informed decision about when to file. Once you are ready to claim, you can either apply online or make an appointment at your local Social Security office. Be sure to have income records handy to verify your eligibility. And remember you need to actively file for benefits, they do not begin automatically. Here are some key points to keep in mind when planning to claim delayed retirement credits. Benefits increase 8% per year up to age 70. It's permanent the higher benefit remains for life. Your spouse can also qualify for increased payments. There is no cap on the amount your benefits can increase. You can work and earn income while delaying benefits. Being able to receive bigger social security checks allows people more flexibility and stability in retirement. This update recognizes that waiting should be rewarded. Let's do a quick recap of the key information. 
The news is that delayed retirement credits will now allow people to increase their Social Security benefits by up to 8% each year past their full retirement age. This means you can maximize your monthly income by waiting to claim. This is available to anyone who is eligible for Social Security based on their work history. To claim the higher amount, you simply need to wait until after your full retirement age, which is likely 66 or 67, before applying for benefits.